A Bay Area flying taxi company just got a half a billion dollar boost from Toyota. KPEX 5's Marie Medina is in San Carlos with what it could take to get the ride of the future off the ground. This is one of Joby Aviation's offices, an aerospace company that's kept its electric air taxi secretive for years. But now with $590 million in funding led by Toyota, the secret could soon be unveiled. This sounds like a pretty cool idea, actually. The future of transportation may soon soar into new heights. This just sounds modern and state-of-the-art and whatnot. Santa Cruz-based startup company Joby just secured Japanese automotive manufacturer Toyota as a new partner to help build Joby's fleet of electric air taxis. I think in our lifetimes we're, we're going to see this. Now it's hard to, it's hard to know when they're going to solve every last technical problem and every last regulatory problem. But this technology is in the realm of possibility. It's not science fiction stuff anymore. But Joby is far from the only company in the race to get air taxis in the sky. Hyundai and Uber just unveiled its air taxi. Joby is also partnering with Uber. The rideshare company plans to build landing pads and give customers the option of choosing a flying taxi versus a car. How much would you pay for an air taxi? Uh, whatever it takes, maybe 20, 30 bucks. Joby isn't clear about how much each sky ride will cost, instead saying it would cost as much as ground transportation at some point in the future. If that's the case, experts say the idea will take off. This doesn't work if it's only for the millionaires among us. Uh, that doesn't solve any of our transportation problems. Uh, the point is to make this a viable means of transportation for, uh, for regular folks. And Joby just released new details about its air taxi. It would have five seats, could travel 150 miles before it needs a recharge, and would be quieter than an airplane. In San Carlos, Marie Medina, KPIX 5.